Boom! What's good? YouTube. <clears throat> Today I'm coming at y'all with another video. You know what? Today I'm I, I'm look at me stuttering like a fucking bitch. I'm coming at you with the back-to-back -back uploads for the first time in a long time. You know, we really on this shit. Y'all really thought I was capping. Y'all really thought I was about to upload and then not upload ever again. But we're on, we're on this. Now listen. Today, as you can probably see by the title, I'm going on a TikTok rant, ladies and gentlemen. I'm tired of this app. I think Donald should have took that shit away. I think he should have deleted it. Get the app off of the app store. Fuck TikTok. TikTok is the reason why I set a social media limit on my phone. I'm only allowed to be on social media for an hour on my phone. And you know why? It's because of TikTok. TikTok is an addiction. You can get addicted to that app. I swear to God you can. And I'll tell you the reasons why right now. I literally wrote a little list. A list of reasons like I'm making a school essay. Watch this. So first. TikTok is too sexually tempting. Now listen to me. Y'all probably looking at me and saying. My nigga. What? And now I understand what you're, where you're coming from, but you have to understand where I'm coming from. Now listen, if you go on TikTok, there's too many dances and too many challenges that are just females showing ass. The WAP dance. The fucking let me say this ass on oh, that shit. What, are, what even is that? That's blatant child. That, I don't know what to call that. Is what, what, what is it, child porn? I don't know. I don't know what I'm watching. What am I watching? What else? What else can I think of? Fuck, I don't know, man. Like y'all see, y'all can tell that I, I, I'm only on that shit for an hour a day because it's too much. I don't even know. Well, let me think of some other shit though. Well, I don't know, bro. I can't think of other shit, but you know, there's millions and different of sounds and challenges and dances of females just objective sign themselves showing their body. And now I know what y'all feminists are about to say in my comment section. It doesn't matter. What do you know? You can't decide what women do with their body. Okay, sure. I can't, right? But I can have an opinion on what I want to see on the fucking platform, right? I can have an opinion, right? So, and my opinion is, that shit is weird. Like, I mean, I'm not complaining because I'm not gay, right? But at the same time, I might want to sign up for an LGBTQ plus subscription. But, I'm not gay, right? But, I'm so I'm not going to complain. But it's just like, bro, don't you just feel a little bit weirded out, sh like, posting yourself, just twerking for millions and thousands of people to see? And you know there's pedos on the app, right? There are men who are out here watching these WAP challenges going crazy at night. D does that not weird you out a little bit? Like, bro, it's weird. It's weird. Like, am I the only one? And it's just like, like, you're just sexualizing yourself at such a young age, IMO, right? Don't come for me. Like I said, I don't want, I don't want no feminist in my comment section. Don't come for me. You're just sexualizing yourself at such a young age. It's like, bro, our society should not be like that. But I'm I'm just I'm gonna move off of that for now because I have other points to get to. Relationship goals, posts, the shit that they use that one Juice World leak to, like fucking uh, cigarettes. I think that's what it's called. That's one of my favorite. It used to be one of my favorite leaks. But you know, don't do that with me. We'll get to that later. But they use that song, bro, and then they just show off their boyfriend and girlfriend. Like that's so it's cool. It's cute. But it's just like for us lonely niggas out there, bro. It hurts. It hurts so much. Like y'all don't get it, bro. It's like, damn, I'm really down this bad. Like you know what I mean? Like it hurts, bro. That shit is so tough to see on your screen. And it's just like, wow. Everyone else is living the life I want to live. When can I have it? It's like you know, it's a lot of pain. It's just a lot of pain. And going into that next post, we got pain talks, right? Now pain talks. I have no problem with them. I think pain talks are the reason why the app should stay up. But it's just like, we're all in pain. And pain talks are the only reason that men especially were able to finally express how they feel. We had to use TikTok. 
talk, we had to use a, a, a humorous form of entertainment to express how we really feel. And that's not how society should be. And even then, some people still don't care. There's niggas out here making the most suicidal pain talks and niggas don't give a fuck. Females or males, they don't give a fuck. And that's kind of sad. Like, some pain talks are good comedy, but other pain talks, we just sit down and recognize, like, damn, is this nigga okay? You know what I mean? But on to the next. Enabling cancel culture. This one is a big one. This one's one that I actually did want to talk about. Y'all remember uh, fucking Jack, whatever that nigga's name is, Nick, right? Nick, the nigga that used to do, like, the blank face, blank stare shit, and then, you know, like, the reaction videos. He got banned? Because he did, like, funny-ass videos, let me get you, like, it was, I remember exact one, it was, like, a transgender, like, it was a female that went into, and transgendered into a man in a TikTok, and he did a reaction to that, and he got cancelled by the gay community, and he got banned, he got banned for that, like, and the thing is, if anyone from a straight community were to try to cancel a gay person, it wouldn't work out. They're enabled for having an LGBTQ plus subscription. Like, what the fuck is that? He just made faces. And that goes on to my next point. TikTok has burst a generation of straight snowflakes. Straight snowflakes, bro. I don't want to hear it, bro. If you say any opinion that is somewhat controversial in any type of form, you'll get canceled. You'll get canceled. They'll unfollow you. They'll do the most to show that you're such a bad person for stating your opinion. Like, bro, what? So, like, it's like, all of a sudden you just can't think the way that you want to think anymore, and you can't publicize your opinion without getting cancelled. That shit is ass. What is that? That shit is so dumb. And we, TikTok is the main reason that that generation even comes close to existing. It shouldn't happen. <laughs> now look, on to my last point, right? And that is ruining music. I'm not trying to be a gatekeeper, right? But once I saw some shit like money trees being used for fucking TikTok dances, it's like, bro. TikTok has single handedly ruined, like, pretty much all my favorite artists. They took away Cardi from me. And. Like I said, I, I, I want everyone to enjoy the same music as me. I want everyone to enjoy that shit. Everyone deserves to enjoy music. I'm not trying to fucking gatekeep. But it gets to the point where y'all use songs for the cringiest shit. Cardi shouldn't be used for TikTok dances. Kendrick Lamar should be used for TikTok dances. I don't get it. It's so annoying. Like, bro, why does everything have to be a fucking dance or a challenge with y'all? Like, can you, can we just, can we just not enjoy the music to just enjoy it? Can we just enjoy the music to enjoy it? Like, damn, why does everything have to be a fucking dance with y'all niggas, man? Shit's annoying. Like, we get it. Cool. You can, you can hit the moves. You can hit the dice roll. You can hit the freaking, what, what are the generic moves there? I don't remember. I don't watch TikTok dances because they're annoying. But yeah, y'all can hit the dice roll. Y'all can do this, that, and the third. We get it. We get it. Like, can you stop using good songs for them? Like, use some poopy shit. Like, the baby. If y'all use the baby for your freaking TikTok dances, I wouldn't care. I wouldn't care at all. But no, y'all want to go ahead and use all my favorite songs and do the most. I think everyone can vouch for me, too. It's like, no one really enjoys TikTok dances besides the people who do them. <sighs> and on top of that, we let the shittiest people blow up through TikTok. Y'all wanna hear an example? Give me one second. Give me one word. I'm gonna do this live too. Give me a fucking second. Nice! 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 Of course YouTube gives me a damn ad. Like, this is why I don't do this shit. I should've just went to Apple. I knew I should've just went to Apple Music. I knew I should've. Thank you. Hey, DJ Charles over there. Charles over there. Look at 
DJ Cho. DJ Cho. What's up, Bree? What's up, Bree? What's up, Key? What's up, Lisa? Damn. I want my whole career. Boom. Ashley. Ooh, Ashley. Hey. Don't get hot. Don't get hot. Look at that. That's what I need. Hey. 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 Oh my fucking god. That song suck! It suck! And I have to hear it every single day. Every single time I open the app. Oh my god, oh my god, this one too! This one too! Now we're really gonna get now we're really gonna get into it. get it now do y'all get it now cause I don't wanna listen to another I don't wanna listen to another one <laughs> you know what I, I'm, I'm just gonna end the video here man y'all 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 get my point right I, I hope y'all do god damn I hope y'all do cause this shit is aggravating fuck tiktok delete that